This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. Okay, so I just want to speak out uh, one little Indian on Daf Ayin Zayin. The Gemara said that Amasa was the son of a man, and his name was Yisra HaYisraeli. And some say, Yasser HaYishma'eli. And uh, the Gemara says he girded his sword like an Ishmaelite. And he said, anyone who doesn't accept this halacha will be pierced by the sword. This is the tradition I have from the Bezin of Shmuel Ramasi. Amoyni v'loi amoynis, mayavi v'loi mayavis. So Gemara has a kasha. Is he believed? But we have a halacha. Rabbi Ava said the name of Rav, a Tamar Chacham that paskins a halacha. If... He paskins before the Maisa, then we listen to him because he's not Noigea Badavar. If before the story comes to him, he paskins and he teaches Talmidim in the name of his Rebbe, we listen to him. Otherwise, we don't listen to him because we're afraid that um, maybe he's paskining this way because of the story that came to him. So the Gemara says, no, here it's uh, different. Because Shmuel and his Bezdin was alive, so it's, uh, we could uh, fact check over here. So therefore, we're not worried that he's doing it because he's not Gabadavar, because if we, were, if we had any suspicions, we could just uh, go check. He's afraid to lie, because he knows we could check him out. We could call him out on it. So the Chassam Soy from Parshas B'Shalach, he says, based on this Gemara, how was it that we were able to believe Boyaz when Boyaz paskined? Amoyni v'lay amoynis, mayavi v'lay mayavis. And uh, he relied on it, and we let him marry Rus. But wait a second. He paskined that way because the story came to him. So the Gemara says a rule that any chacham that shemoyra halacha uba im koide maisa amra shoimim lev im lavein shoimim lev and Boyaz is paskening when the maisa is bali adai so how is that an acceptable psak? so the chsam soifer says um, he quotes this question from the sefer atzei arazim simen samach beis and he says it's not a question because this is only true if the chacham says it from a kabbalah like Avner said kach mikoblani but if he says it from a drasha, then we listen to him. And how do you know Bayaz said it from Halach Lomashim Yisinai? Maybe he said it from a drasha. And when a chacham says it from a drasha, he could even say it when it's Nagea. That's the answer of the um, the Chassam Soifer. And then he offers another answer. He says, maybe that's why Boyaz not only paskin mayavi v'loi mayavis, he paskin amoyni v'loi amoynis. Because on, on amoynis, he's not noigea bedavar. He's not looking to marry anyone from amoyn. He was looking to marry someone from mayav. So on amoyn, we could say that he is believed. And the isur of amoyn and isur of mayav, like we said on Sunday, are two different isurim. Amoyn is only also for one reason. Advar shaloi kidmu eschem. Mayav is also for two reasons, because they, they didn't give you water, and because they hired um, Bilam. So since it's two different psakim, and legabe the psak of Amoyn, he's believed, so we say migu. Migu that you're believed on Amoyn, you're believed on Mayav as well. That's the Chassam uh, Seifer. It's a very interesting uh, approach of Ruven Margolius in his classic work, Hamikra Vahamasaira, and he asks this question also, he says, Vinei Yadua, ki tamar chacham shemayra halacha shoymin lai, only if he paskins before the story comes to him. And Boyaz was the Rosh Sanhedrin, um, how, do we, how can we accept his psak? So listen to how he learns the story. That's why the Pasuk says, Ohu Vahyaz Allah Hashar Vayeshav Sham. Vayaz went up to the gate to darshan about this halacha before he brought the case to Bezdin whether he's allowed to marry Rus. That's why he woke up early in the morning and Vayaz Allah Hashar. Therefore, Lachin, his dares Vayaz Allah Hashar Lafnei that he was 
before he meets up with the Goyal to ask him, you want to, should I do it? He thought, um, he figured, because if he asked the Goyal, and then he's going to do it, and it's going to be no yeah, him, and then he can't paskin on it anymore. So therefore he went up to the Shar, before he even brought the, b- brought the case in front of Plani Almoini, so at that point in time, Boyaz is still Eino Negea B'davar, and he's all of Bashar, and he paskined, Amoini V'lo Amoini V'lo Amoini V'lo Amoini and once that halacha is Neskabel, then, then he has the conversation with the Goyal, maybe you want to marry her. And uh, now the Psaq's already been grandfathered in before, in other words, that's why he uh, basically preempted the case that came in front of Bezdin, and he paskined halacha before the case was brought up. Anyway, that's uh, the one little point on Daf Ayin Zayin. And uh, with that, Bez Hashem, we will hold it. We'll see everybody next week's schedule. We'll try for Tuesday night and Thursday night, 9.15. Have a wonderful night and bracha uh, Okay? Call to everyone. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.